everyone, Marose still here from Fashion Steel NYC and welcome back to my channel and another Miami weekly vlog. Make sure to give your girl a thumbs up and subscribe if you love fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and travel videos. All right, y'all, we are back. We are back in a 305. We are back in Miami. Um, I also want to send a huge thank you to everyone who like reached out. Um, I know there was a huge storm here. There was a lot of flooding. Um, a lot of you were asking if my home was okay. My house is fine. So thank you guys just for the love and the support. Um, everything is fine. So yeah, I'm back in Miami. I have a few things I need to do here, a few events, and then y'all, we skedaddling right back to New York for Juneteenth because that's where you wanna be. Um, so this morning, I just got myself up. I got myself together, made myself a coffee, you guys, this robe set from Skims, she the one and not the two. I absolutely love this set. I got it during the Memorial Day sales if you watch that haul. Um, I'm wearing a small in the dress and a medium in the robe. It is quite expensive, but it is silk and it feels incredible. And I mean, you're just gonna look amazing. Like a goddess, basically, just floating around your home. Um, so yeah, I'll link this down below. I'll also link um, the other ones that I have. I bought a brown one as well. Um, but yeah, luxury. So incredibly amazing. Um, so yeah, today we are going, and by we, I mean you and me, um, and my girl Rhea. <laughs> We're going to an Olay Henriksen event. Um, I'm really excited to go because I've been wanting to work with the brand. I've heard such great things. I have a lot of friends who work with them, a lot of um, friends who actually just use their products. So very excited to be heading to Esme's rooftop. Y'all know Esme Hotel, my one of my favorites, if not my favorite hotel here in Miami Beach. Um, I love the hotel. They have uh, such a cute vibe. Like I'll show y'all, y'all, I'm gonna take y'all with me. So we're doing that. Tomorrow, I'm doing a shoot with my girl Maria. I need to shoot a few campaigns. And then I'm going on a boat ride with my girl Politics and Fashion, Tashira. Um, she's having her white toenail season event and they invited me on a boat, so your girl's gonna be on a boat. Um, and then I believe next week we have an event with Aero Airlines at ZZ's Club in um, Miami Design District. So this is gonna be a long, very fun filled and fashionable vlog. I know y'all have been asking for longer videos. I just wanted to tone it down a bit, you know. Um, <laughs> you know, I'm trying to attract a wider audience and sometimes the long videos scare new people. So I'm trying to create more vlogs that are just a daily vlog, um, but don't worry, we're gonna get right back. This, uh, this is an experiment actually. For the month of June, um, I'm planning on doing shorter vlogs just to attract a wider audience and then also doing one long vlog a week. So don't worry y'all. And also I'm just busy. Y'all see me moving and shaking? Um, but this is a weekly vlog, it's nice and long. Get your coffee, get your, your wine, your water, your snacks. Settle in, it's gonna be a good one. Um, actually, I did get into town yesterday um, and right off the bat, my girl Rhea wanted to do um, a dine. And so we actually headed to Kaori, um, which is a Asian fusion restaurant in Brickell, literally right around the corner from East Hotel Miami. Y'all know that's one of my favorite hotels in downtown Miami. It's right there ac across from Brickell City Center very very close to sexy fish which is another restaurant y'all need to check out if you come to miami um so yeah what i'm gonna do is just go ahead and rewind it back to last night when i'm getting ready to head out um, i'm gonna roll that footage take y'all on the night with us show you guys this incredible six course meal incredible um and then we'll come back to present day and i will already be dressed and ready to head to the ole Henriksen event at Esme. So let's go ahead and rewind that beautiful bean footage and I'll see you guys back here momentarily. Hey y'all. So I'm getting myself together. Sorry about the echo. Um, Rhea, my girl Rhea, Michelle, and I are heading to a dinner. 
Um, we are going to Kaori, which is an Asian fusion restaurant in downtown Miami. They have comped us, I believe, a five course meal of like sushi. Um, so I'm very, very excited about it. She told me to dress for success. And so I put on my favorite dress from Rat and Boa. Like every time I wear this dress, I just feel so beautiful. I feel like a goddess. I feel super sexy and elegant. And I think it's perfect for an Asian fusion dinner tonight in downtown. Um, so yeah, happy to be back in Miami. Um, I did a really simple face. I used the Sephora brow pencil to basically draw in my brows or um, kind of fill them in because I have pretty decent brows. And then I use a little bit of La Mercier concealer to just kind of get them together. I think I'm going to do an updated makeup routine because I have been doing something a little different. I have been using uh, a tinted moisturizer instead of using foundation but then a lot of you are asking what skincare am I using as well so we'll do a whole skincare get ready with me um, soon the lip I always go with the brown lip um, this one is from Fenty it's Fenty Unveil I don't know what it is about me and brown lipstick but it just works <laughs> let me show you guys the full outfit I'm gonna call my alto so happy to be back in Miami so I can Get driven around because the ubers in new york were really <laughs> y'all they high it's high it's it's you gotta factor it into your lifestyle at this moment it's a bill it's a bill you gotta pay so i'm very happy to be back here and um be able to ride with alto i do still have a code with them it's monroe 20 all capital letters for twenty dollars off your first two rides you do have to sign up for like the 30-day trial you can always cancel all right, let me show you guys the full look, the bag, the scent, the shoe, and we are going to head to Kaori and hopefully, I just know the food is going to be good. It's going to be good, but we, I'm going to take y'all with me. Let's go. So y'all would have seen this dress in my So Nice I Bought It Twice video. Um, I love a little rat and boa. Let's pick a fragrance for tonight. Of course, we're going to do, you know what? I always do Baccarat. I think I'm gonna do Gentle Fluidity. Maison Francis, Kurt Dijon. So I'm feeling very light and airy and golden and goddess-like tonight. So we'll spray on a little bit of that. And then I think I'm gonna mix it with this, which I haven't worn in a while. This is Te Divina by Caudalie. Um, this is very, very, very affordable. It smells incredible. I forgot what's in it, um, but I'll put this, I'll put y'all onto this about two years ago when I first got it in Paris and I've been obsessed with it ever since. I think it's like 30 or 40 bucks. It smells incredible. Um, it also comes in like an oil for your body and your hair. Oh, so good. I'll make sure to link this down below for you guys. Whoo, that smells incredible, that combination. For the bag, of course, we're gonna do my Brandon Blackwood, the black bamboo. Um, it just goes. Let's pick an earring. Do I wanna wear my click clack bracelet? I don't know. Should I do something understated? Ooh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do my idol um, diamonds. So remember, these are lab grown diamonds, and then I have the add ons. These are very, very chic. So these are the add-ons. I hope you can see it. Come on and focus. There we go. This is the add-on. It has like the two diamonds. So then you just pop it onto this one to make it like a dangling diamond earring, which I love. So we're going, we're going big tonight. So we'll do these diamonds, which I love. I'll link these down below. I've worn them nonstop since I've gotten them. I can't even front. And I'm not even like a stud kind of girl. Y'all know that I love a hoop, a big, fancy, in your face earring. But lately, because my hair is long, um, I've been doing more dainty earrings and more like studs and things. But these are so stunning. Very, very classic. And very affordable for diamonds. Alrighty, 
So those are the earrings. I'm gonna put on the matching necklace, also from Idol. I hope they work with me again because I see, I was checking out the website the other day. They're having like a sale. And I see so many things that I want. I probably would just end up purchasing them. All right, so I think that's it for jewelry. And then of course I have on my Cartier um, love bracelet. This is the thickest one. I get asked that a few times. And ring, Majuri ring, and diamond ring that I, I can never remember where I got it from. The shoes, we're going with my Givenchy heels. These are old. But let me tell y'all, Givenchy, when it comes to shoes, they have really amazing footwear. I need to find out who designs their shoes because they're so creative. The shoes are like no, no kind of shoe you've ever seen before. Like these that I just got from Givenchy are literally my favorite pair of sandals. I've been wearing them so much. I feel like I need another pair just in case. Just in case. All right, guys, all set. Let me show you the full outfit. All right, guys, so this is the full fit wearing this rat and boa sheer black floral dress um it is sheer but you can't see anything through it i do not have on a pasty or anything and literally you can see nothing um i do have on like kind of thicker boy short underwear that are seamless um but you can't see those either so that's the thing i love about this dress and the shape of it is so good it's so flattering on every single body type I've seen wear this dress, fabulous. Um, definitely one of my favorite dresses of all time. We have my Brandon Blackwood bag, my Idol Diamond jewelry, and you can't even really see my heels, but just in case, barely there, Givenchy sandals. Um, anything that's still available, I'll link down below. And all of my dresses from Rat and Boa, I get them in a medium. I'm normally a US size six, 28 in jeans. The medium fits me perfectly. So yeah, and in case you're wondering, I'm five foot six. So the dresses are very long. So if you're a short gal, um, it's gonna be very, very long on you. But sometimes, you know, that's a good look. Just get it hemmed. All right, y'all, let's go.
guys. So I hope you enjoyed coming with us last night to Kaori, Miami in downtown uh, Miami. It was so good. Out of like all six courses, I think my favorite was, let's see. I love the crispy prawns, so delicious. I also really loved the, the skirt steak, so good. The buns were great. The dessert was like a vegan pistachio ice cream. And you guys know I love pistachio, but I cannot eat dairy um, like that. <laughs> um, so the fact that it was vegan was incredible. It was so good. The ambiance in there, super sexy. So if you're looking for a great restaurant to go to, like for a date night or you're visiting Miami and you're staying in the downtown area or you're staying at East Miami Hotel, literally just walk over to Kaori and get your entire life. Um, but yeah, such a fun night. And now I got myself together to head to Esme Hotel for the Olay Henriksen event. I did a very everyday simple face. Um, of course, still using my Beauty Counter Tinted Moisturizer. No foundation, just tinted moisturizer. Um, the earrings are Louis Vuitton. I've had these for a while, but I always forget that I, <laughs> that I have them. So I'm wearing them today. The necklace is from Majuri. Um, I'll show you my outfit momentarily, but it's from A Paris. I've actually shot this outfit. I'll pop a few photos up here from my Instagram. And you should be following me on Instagram at Monroe Steel. Um, if you follow me over there, you'll definitely see a lot of things that happen on the vlogs for, first. And also outfits that I wear, you'll see them first if you're following me on Instagram. And hopefully by the time, you know, it comes to the video, sometimes it's already sold out. So if you don't want to miss out, head on over there. There's a link to it in my description box. Um, but this event is on a rooftop and it's hot today. Like the sun is beaming down. Y'all know the Miami sun don't play. Y'all see this tan? So I'm definitely going to try out my new K skin. This is by uh, Winnie Harlow. The Isle Glow Body Lotion SPF 45. I'm going to put it here on my shoulders, my chest, and my arms since I am going to be pretty <laughs> exposed today. Um, but they sent this as a gift and I did an unboxing. I think the unboxing was actually on my Insta stories, not on YouTube. So yeah, this is what it looks like. I'm gonna give you guys a quick little review here. So it melts into your skin really easily and it kind of gives you a glow. So here's the arm with it on, here's the arm with no glow. You see that difference? Y'all see it, don't act like y'all don't see it. So I'll be sure to link this down below. It doesn't leave a cast. This is actually made for people of color, this uh, SPF. So yeah, I love that. It does give you just glowy, beautiful skin, like sun kiss. And I have been loving this. They also created one for your face which I'll link below. And then they also have an oil. Like I've never used an SPF oil before, but tomorrow when I go on the boat, I'm gonna take the oil and see how that fares. Oop. Let's not get demonetized. Y'all see that glow? Oh, it's very subtle, but uh, I mean, it's giving island. It's giving island goddess. It's giving I just got off a boat straight from Saint Tropez. Um, it's giving. I spent a week in Barbados. It's just giving. All right, guys. So here is today's full look. I'm wearing this A Paris two-piece set. It's a silk um, skirt and a matching silk top. The silk top is actually just like a scarf, and that's how it came. Um, and I just tied it in the back to make like a shirt um yeah so it has like this watercolor look with pinks merging into yellows really lovely you can see how i tied it in the back um if they still have this i'll link it down below but it's fairly old um i paired it with my bottega 
uh, pink stretch mules. Very, very comfortable. I'm going to be standing probably a lot. So yeah, went for these shoes. And then for the bag, of course, a great conversation starter. My sequins um, Fendi baguette that kind of like matches this entire outfit. Um, so like I said, life hack, if you are a business owner or you are just looking to make connections, if you wear something that's going to spark a conversation or that will make people remember you, that's always a great idea. This bag is that for me. Um, to break the ice, someone always will come up and say, oh wow, like that's a beautiful bag. And I'm like, oh thanks. You know, I'm really into fashion. It's part of my job. It kind of segues, you know. So yeah, loving this outfit. Anything that's available, I will link down below for you guys. Um, we're going to choose a fragrance. Probably going to grab my Alexander McQueen sunglasses and head out. All right, let's choose a fragrance. Uh, I think we're going to go again with my Caudalie Tate Vigna. I've just been loving how this smells. And anytime I wear it, I get so many compliments even though it's fairly like inexpensive. Um, I love it. It's great for my hair too. And then I think I'll mix it with a little, you know what, let's go with my new perfume. I don't know if I showed you guys this, but I got this Amber Nargule perfume from Hermes. And anytime someone walks by and they're wearing this, I instantly know what it is. So I'm gonna mix it with this. Just maybe like, three or four pumps. Ooh, I love this. This smells like summer in a bottle. Oh, so good. Okay, so that is today's fragrance. Gonna... Oh my goodness, I thought I left my sunglasses in New York, y'all. I was about to go off. I'm gonna go for my Alexander McQueen pink sunglasses. And I love that they have a little silver because the inside of these earrings are silver from Louis Vuitton. So everything just kind of coordinates. I love that for us. All right guys, let's head to the event. banana bright serum because it is one of the most potent transformative transformational products. I was pioneered by my seed decades ago, decades years ago. In this
guys back from the Ola Henriksen event at Esme Hotel. You guys, it is raining like crazy right now. Like, I had to take off my shoes to hop a puddle to like get into my apartment. You guys, crazy. Anywho, such a wonderful event. Ola is so vibrant. Like, it's hard to believe he's 70 years old. Um, but we got a gift bag, so I quickly want to show you what I got, and then I'm going to close out the vlog for today. So many melanated beauties at this event, which I love to see. Um, my shoes, which I took off to protect. <laughs> but in this bag, oh my God, you guys hear the, the thunder? Let me tell you, if you're coming to Miami, know that it rains every day around 2 o'clock for about 30 minutes to 45 minutes. And not just a little bit of rain. It's drenching rain. And then it like goes away. Um, and the sun will come out. But yeah, there was a towel in here. I used it to cover up my head. So right now it's in the washer. They also gave us a cute little water bottle. It says... Ola loves Miami. Very cute, very aesthetic. You know, this will be great for working out. And in, in fact, I have a glass of water right here from my workout um, this morning, which I did not film. <laughs> they also gave us uh, the Monaco belt. It's a gold belt by the brand Love AJ, which is really cute. I love belts like this for summer. I think they just add a little oomph to any outfit. Like how freaking cute is this? And then it has this little gold like button there. Can you see this with like a little uh, midi dress for spring and summer? Very, very cute. If I can find this, I'll link it down below. I've never heard of this brand. It is... Sivan Aya? I'm not sure. I've never heard of this brand, um, but it's super cute. And I'll try and find it and link it down below. Y'all, this thunder is crazy. You can hear the thunder when it's still like pristine, beautiful, blue skies, sun out. You hear the thunder way before like the clouds roll in. It's crazy. Last but not least, we have the two hero products of the night. Um, Ole Henriksen is now doing body products. You probably have used their skincare products. They have vitamin C products, peptide products, um, most of them for your face. They are now getting into body. Um, and now they have the Beam Cream Smoothing Body Moisturizer, which has AHA. Y'all know AHA, wonderful for your skin, for smoothing. Um, fine lines, wrinkles, all that good stuff. Fruit enzymes, great for helping with hyperpigmentation, dark spots, um, and caffeine to literally wake up your skin, um, which I absolutely love. So basically, it's just a body moisturizer with caffeine, um, very aesthetically pleasing packaging. I smelled it already, but I want to I wanna smell it again. Y'all know I'm a tourist, so... We are very smell-oriented people, and we have to smell it. Um, so let me give y'all the tea. This is what it looks like. Super creamy. It smells very, very light. Almost like, like a light grapefruit, almost. I want to put a little on. Very rich. Very creamy. Immediately melts into your skin. But light still almost like a light grapefruit coffee smell but very moisturizing like ooh, i like that um definitely check this product out i will link it down below i think the thing that makes this special is that it has aha and a lot of products that have this are mainly for your face so if you want your face to be bomb if you're using everything for your face but not your body like your body, your face is going to be looking amazing, but your body going to be looking not the same. So let's even that out. I'll link this down below. I'm pretty sure you can get it at Sephora. This is what I was really excited about because I saw my girl Aching actually do um, a campaign 
um, with this product. It is the Firmly Yours Toning Dry Body Oil. Now, I love a body oil, but the thing about a body oil is that it does get everything like messy. I could never wear a body oil and then put on this silk two-piece set like it's going to ruin it. But what I love about this is this is a dry body oil. As soon as you put it on and rub it in, it literally seeps into your skin, doesn't leave any oil residue. So it's a dry body oil. It has elderberry oil, sweet white lupin extract, and vegan peptides, all of which are great for your skin. So here it is. Can you see it? So here it is. I took the top off. I just want to try a little bit of it. Because I saw my friend use it and it looked like it was just. It looked like it was just bomb. Okay. It has the same kind of scent. Very kind of light, slightly citrus. Almost like a coffee ground as well and it works. I'm shiny without anything left over to get on my clothing. So yeah, love these. I will be using these and I will report back to let you guys know how they work. I'll link both of them down below. I'm not sure what I'm doing later. I might end up doing something. If so, I will vlog. If not, this is it for today. Um, and I will tune back in tomorrow when maria and i are shooting a few things we're shooting some campaigns i have a campaign i'm shooting for uh walmart i no not walmart um marshall's and yeah a few other things amazon i'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek of my amazon the drop collection soon here on youtube um but if you want to make sure you don't miss my drop it's only available to shop for 30 hours via amazon click the link in my pinned comment or down in the description box that says sign up for notifications for amazon it's going to lead you to a page that probably has someone else's photo because my photo won't be there until it's my drop but if you follow my link scroll down to the middle of the page somewhere where it says get notified about upcoming um, the drop collections it's gonna sign you up for my drop because you're coming from my link this link is special to me so yeah if you use the link scroll down sign up it's gonna sign you up for my drop so you'll get an email when it drops and it's dropping soon now I don't want you guys to miss it wow I don't want you guys to miss it so yeah sign up so that you can shop my Amazon The Drop collection and also follow me on Instagram at Monroe Steel, M-O-N-R-O-E-S-T-E-E-L-E -E -E, um, so that you can see, cause I showed a little bit of the collection already on Instagram. So if you're not following me there, you're missing out. All right guys, I will check back in with you all tomorrow. together 
Maria is here and we are about to shoot a few things. First up is one of the pieces from my Amazon The Drop collection. If you've been watching my stories on Instagram, you guys saw I wanted to do a two-tone um, like knit midi dress. And I absolutely love it. It's this royal purple, which I think is a great color for summer and also transitioning into fall. And then this kind of like grayish color. Um, I think this is a, a super cute dress. It fits really well. I'm wearing a medium. Um, so we'll show you a little bit behind the scenes of shooting this look for Amazon. Make sure you sign up for my collection by clicking the link in my pinned comment or in the description box. My face won't be there. A lot of people are like, oh, I don't see you. I don't see where to sign up. Literally just scroll down until you see something that says sign up for text notifications or notifications for upcoming drops. Click that, sign in, um, and then when my drop happens, you'll get an email, you'll get a text so that you don't miss it. But I did put this on my stories and a lot of people said that they love this one. So we decided to go ahead and put this one into production. Let me give you guys a sneak peek of a few more pieces which I am allowed to show. So we did end up getting a few samples made of the watercolor. I put this on my stories and you guys voted um, that you like two piece sets. So we created this really cool like two piece watercolor set with a top. Look at those green buttons and the contrast stitching y'all. This also kind of folds up on the sleeve and a matching like midi skirt. Super cool. The great thing about this print because I wanted a watercolor print is that it features all of my favorite colors for summer. We have the green, we have orange. We have a vibrant like red and pink and those colors are in all of the pieces and it's also one of a kind. So no two pieces are going to be exactly the same because they're watercolor like on a gradient. Um, but all of these colors will be in every piece and this has a little slit too. Um, I might actually just pop in a few cutaways here showing a little bit of the collection that we have started to film, we have started to shoot to kind of see how everything looks and kind of narrow it down. So you guys let me know what you think of these pieces. So far my collection is coming soon. So yeah, make sure you're following me on Instagram so you can vote on these things so that we can see which pieces are going to be made and such. All right, guys, so we're gonna go ahead and shoot this um, and then we are gonna shoot three things for Marshalls and then we're gonna shoot a campaign um, for Aperol Spritz. Busy, busy day, but afterwards we are gonna head to a boat. <laughs> I'm chilling with my girl Politics and Fashion today to Shira here on YouTube. Definitely give her a follow, Politics and Fashion. She is hilarious, she is so authentic and real and I just love her. Um, she just pours into everyone she knows. So yeah, I'm really ready to hang out with her again. The last time we hung out was during Fashion Week. All right guys, let's go shoot. I will go ahead and roll the shooting footage. A haul in I'll link it down below I'm wearing the medium pour myself a little champagne or actually it's Prosecco and my friends here Hello. Ria Michelle go follow her on Instagram at 
Rhea Michelle. Yes, she has a YouTube channel. No, she doesn't post anything on there. So you're gonna wanna follow her on Instagram instead for all of, like literally, to know everything that's happening in Miami. She's your girl. <laughs> Restaurants, events, everything. She got you. So instead of coming over and <laughs> asking me, I mean, you can still ask me. Just go, go ask her. She know better than me. So she helped me shoot a campaign today. So now I'm gonna go buy her lunch. And I'll take you guys with us. I don't know where we're going yet, but we'll see. I need to eat before I go on this boat. All right guys, so just adding my Alexander McQueen sunglasses, my Chanel bag from Fashion File. You guys have seen this dress from Karen Millen. We are gonna head and get some food. Gotta get some food in my system before hitting this boat, um, but it should be fun. That was a really great session with my girl Maria. Definitely check her out, Bella Rosa blog on Instagram and here on YouTube. Sorry guys, I just came up the steps and I'm out of breath. <laughs> um, but yeah, excited about lunch, coming back here, cleaning up a bit, and then heading to meet politics and fashion. My girl Tashira on her white toenail season boat ride. Should be a really eventful day. And I might go to dinner tonight too, we'll see. So here's the full look. I'm gonna wear my orange Bottega mules. Ignore the mess. <laughs> Again, we've been shooting all morning. Um, but yeah, let's go to lunch. did a little bit of work. Rhea and I went to this really nice restaurant over on uh, Lincoln Road. It's called Isabella's. It's like a Mediterranean restaurant for lunch. It was absolutely delicious. We got the Branzino for two. We got a Mediterranean salad. We got the grilled octopus. Um, I had the Rosini and also a glass of champagne and everything was delicious. The service was A1. So if you're hanging out on Lincoln Road and looking for just a really nice restaurant to eat um, where the food is A1 and the ambiance is immaculate, definitely check out Isabella's. All right, so I came back, did a little work. I put back on this swimsuit from Rat and Boa. It's the one I wore at the one hotel in Brooklyn, but never got to take any photos or actually dip in the pool in a previous vlog. Um, so I just put that back on. It is so cute. I love that it has like zebra print and then like a watercolor with blue and oranges and browns. And then it has this little matching zebra sarong with these little tassels at the bottom. Um, my bag for today is gonna be this uh, Stodd bag that's orange um, and canvas. I think it's super cute. I already sprayed on a little perfume. We're going with my Hermes um, Amber Nar Nargaile. Hopefully I'm saying that correctly. It smells really super fresh and just like fun since we're gonna be on a boat. And I think for my sunglasses, I'm just gonna take my favorite black sunglasses from And Other Stories. 
that I cannot seem to find. They must be downstairs by the door because that's usually where I keep them. All right, guys, so I already called my Alto and I'm, I think I'm going to throw a towel in here. I'm not sure if they'll have towels on the yacht. Um, my car is almost here. For the shoes, we are going with my new Chanel Mule slides. I got these from Bergdorf when I was in New York a couple of vlogs ago. So we're just gonna wear these. You know, you always need a good flat for a boat and these are actually really comfortable. Am I gonna wear an earring? I don't know. Oh, I need to put on my little ankle bracelet. I also need to put on some sunblock. We're actually gonna pack that in the bag as well. So I don't know if I'm getting in the water, I'll need to reapply. Um, I kind of want to do a moment, like I want to take a photo, so maybe I will bring an earring, put on my Hermes click clack. So yeah, I think I will do an earring, but I'll just take it off like once I'm ready to like finish taking my photos and like getting, you know, the content. Um, let's see, how about these? Right. What do you guys think about these? I don't even know where I got these. I think these are Cult Gaia maybe. But they're cool. They're like uh like the acetate. Is that what, what it's called? They're cute. I think these might work. We'll go with these. If I can still find these anywhere, I'll link them down below. I did refresh my makeup, but I don't really care since <laughs> We're gonna be on a boat for most of the time anyway. In the hot sun, I know I'm gonna sweat. So it's fine if my makeup slides off my face, but I do have on some sunscreen and my tinted moisturizer also has SPF. So I think I'm good to go. Let's pack you guys up and let's head to the boat to meet my girl, Tashira. Politics and fashion, she's amazing. I think we're gonna have an excellent night. It's been a minute since I've done like a night cruise or a night yacht, so stay tuned. How rude of me. Let me show you guys the full look, even though you've seen it before if you watched a previous vlog. Love the little fringe at the bottom. Got my cowrie shell anklet on. I'll link a few of the anklets down below. And my new Chanel Mules side bag. I believe these are Coke Guy earrings. Um, yeah, I love Rat and Boa's swimsuits. This is a micro swimsuit, so, you know, take that into mind when purchasing because this little triangle is very small. So, yeah. All right, guys, let's go have a fun boat, yacht, white toe. And my toes are white. They are always white. Always and forever. Um, you know, boat day. I'll make sure to try and link uh, everybody down below.
sweaty. We saw some dolphins. It was amazing. I just got finished dancing. You know? <laughs> saw the dolphins? Very, very. Yes, yeah, saw the dolphins. Good. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, y'all.